Yeah. Nah, Zemily. Rudimental. Just trying to find my way home. Home, sweet home. I'm free as I ever been. No discount, no sale, half off. I'm too intelligent. Sometimes you think things are all bad till you find yourself, till you be yourself. So when things are all bad, remember that this too shall pass. Hands up, my survivors. We gotta be brave as coal miners. It's a heavy chain that locks he who could not mentally be free So there he is for eternity I don't let nothing worry me My boy just came home from serving three years His girl loves someone else and he fears He's going through something else to someone To put himself back in the trap Cause he couldn't adapt in the streets Only in jail he feels free It's so sorry Just trying to find my way home Home sweet home Yeah graduate of WWE Hall of Famer Steve Hart's famous dungeon, there isn't anything Chris Jericho can't do in the ring or can't handle from an opponent. Hey, that's why he's the best in the world at what he does.
Chris Jericho developed his famous finishing move, the Lion Tamer Submission Hole. And in recent years, because that wasn't punishing enough, Jericho introduced the Code Breaker, which is a form of a backbreaker. So Jericho has two finishing moves that he can use at any time. Wow, what a slam to the ground. He's got a nasty looking object in his hands. Oh, look at that forearm. You hear how his leg connected? Wow, he's still down after that. Oh, and did you hear the impact? And the table is used again. He's just brutalizing his opponent with that table. The table. Well, Michael, we all know how adamant Chris is about his proclamation that he is the best in the world at what he does. When you have two finishing moves, it definitely means you take punishing your opponents seriously. No! Oh, did you hear that splatter? It sounded like somebody took a racket to a wet blanket. He tells me this won't be good. And he gets back in the ring. Let me remind everybody, there are no count outs. These competitors can stay out here as long as they like. And we're going back between the ropes. And Christian reverses it. Yeah, that's good because that could have been bad for Christian. In a statement as we speak. You don't want to do this. Oh, and did you hear the impact? He didn't need a GPS to find the mark. The career of Chris Jericho has literally spanned the globe. Jericho trained in the famous Heart Dungeon in Calgary, Canada. He competed in Mexico, Japan, Smoky Mountain, ECW, and WCW, all before coming to WWE. And in WWE, well, Jericho has done it all, including being the first ever undisputed WWE Champion. A table, oh my God! he is to react right now. Come on, put that down. Now back to the ring. Michael, you should know by now that I don't mince words. Like I said before, Jericho has done it all in this industry. Heck, I wouldn't be surprised if one day he finagles his way into a Divas title reign. If he can win this struggle, he might just win the match. Oh, man, that was a hard landing. Oh, my gosh, he nearly fell. Oh, don't slip. Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. Watch it. That was the greatest. That was the greatest. Oh, not again. Now climbing one rung of the ladder at a time. reasons Chris Jericho is so and he gets taken right off the ladder. Oh, back to the head. Back to the temple. This guy's just almost there. Oh, I think he lost his footing. That's not how you do it.
And he does it one more time. Ooh. Somehow, someway, he figured out a way to make this even more violent. And I think it's obvious that he'll stop at nothing to win. Oh, no! Oh, my gosh! I thought he was going to get leveled there. To your point about Christian's diverse. Going up the ladder again. Does he have it? He did it! Chris Jericho wins! And here's just some... We got a couple of highlights here. Here is your winner and the new Intercontinental Champion, Chris Jericho. What a tribute to the athletes of the WWE. Having superstars of this caliber put on a performance like they did in this ladder match.